and the ladies wanted to know why you were such a big fan of of uh, cutting the shirt off, showing off your stomach. And the second question of that is, do you think that'll ever make a comeback among defensive tackles? <laughs> well, again, good and bad. Uh, the <laughs> the the bad part is, I hope not because the the guts some of these guys have are unbelievable. Um, however, um, I, I kind of showed my gut because, um, and, and this is kind of a, it's a really kind of funny story, but um, for some reason, uh, at the University of Aim, we didn't throw away our, our old jerseys. So if you can imagine, I'm sure there was probably some jerseys there back in the day from Rockney. I mean, no lie. When we, when I got there. During the summer, we were practicing, and you can imagine kind of like thick wool jerseys that they have like in the 50s. That's what we practiced in. Oh. And I'm sitting there going, okay, you're kidding me. This is a major university, and we have these old school jerseys. And I remember being so hot, and I just went and grabbed some scissors from one of our trainers, and I, I cut my jersey in half because I just couldn't handle it. And so – then on, I just always cut my jerseys because they had these old school jerseys that I was like on fire. I mean, I was so hot that I had to have some type of ventilation, and so that's the reason why I cut it. And then, you know, it was just, just it just kind of became a part of who I was to the point where you know we're playing in, in cold environments and it's snowing, and I, I still cut my jersey in half. And then they were very kind; they wound up uh, sewing the bottom of it for me too. So I was. Very lucky. I didn't have to do that myself. Well, that answers the question, ladies. If you wanted to know why, it was because he was hot. So I know if that. I don't know if that's a good answer or a bad answer. There you That's go. That's the ladies. only reason why. 